Hello everyone. Just want to make a quick little video, a little overview of my 2016 Ram 1500 5.7 liter Hemi. Uh, I'll just tell you a few things that I've done to it. Um, the first thing you can see is probably the first thing I did was debadge the whole truck. So I took off the Ram 1500 emblems, the Hemi 5.7 Hemi emblems. Uh, the 4x4 four four emblems in the back. 4x4 four four emblems in the back are gone. I swapped these, this, uh, the Ram's head. It used to be chrome. I swapped it with a, a black one from, I got off Amazon. It should be, it, it was a gen, uh, genuine uh, Mopar one. I also did the front one. They were black factory Mopar emblems, so I took the silver one off the front and did that. So the next thing you can see is I got the 20 by 10 Fuel Maverick wheels with a negative 18 offset with a 305 50 20 Nitto 420S tires. You can see they stick out just a little bit in there. I also added, obviously, the window tint. I did window tint. Got the uh, bed cover on here. X-Tang Trifecta. I also did... Also have it Rhino line on the inside. Came factory with the lights inside here. I put the tailgate assist rod on here. Makes it nice and easy. Uh, I also did LED license plate lights. I also put LED fog lights and headlights in. So I got those from uh, Diode Dynamics. Let the fog lights come on. I can't get the fog lights to come on without being on. Anyway, these guys get the idea. Uh, so as far as performance mods, well, this isn't really performance, but I did put an AEM wideband gauge in the truck um, I do have let me pop the hood here I'll show you what we did underneath so the first thing that pops out is the s and cold air intake that goes over to a most performance 88 millimeter ported throttle body. Um, I also did the V6 fan modification. Um, those of you that have this modification, be careful with the upper radiator hose tends to uh, get cut on this thing right here. So what I did was I just put this uh, piece of plastic over it. Got a new radiator hose because mine almost had a hole all the way through it. So uh, we did that. Uh, also got also got the catch can. You can see that there. The catch can. I got a, a Loden or Milodon or however you want to say it. 180 degree thermostat. Uh, I also did uh, active grill shutter delete. I don't, can, I don't think we can see them or lack of them. So I got the, the modules right here. I forget where I got the kit. I think, I can't remember where I got this kit from, but uh, it stops the code from coming up for the, for the shutters. Um, here's some of the wiring for the uh, wide band sensor. And I also have American Racing. I don't know if you can see these or not. American Racing. Inch and seven eight headers. 
not real sure if you could see them, but they're in there. One and seven eight inch primary to a three inch collector with cats. So I do have catalytic converters on here. Let me go under here. Sorry about this video. I'm terrible at this stuff. Here's the Y pipe. You can see the headers there. And it goes to a nice merge collector. And it goes back to my three inch Corsa exhaust system. Let's see. This is the passenger side. Also forgot to mention, I did lower the back of the truck two inches. Uh, I know McGowey's or however you say, it has two inch lowering springs. These are not them. Uh, I got these springs. I think it's performance suspension off uh, Amazon, two inch drop springs. <clears throat> And it actually sat a little too low, so I had to get, well, I didn't have to, but I got McBay Performance half inch uh, coil spring spacers. So I lifted the truck up a little bit half inch just to tailor the ride into what I wanted, wanted it to be. So that's the springs there. Still running the factory sway bar shocks and the uh, upper and lower control arms. They're all, everything's factory see the rest of the uh the course of muffler here it's huge it's big so, so that's about all can uh can actually give a little warm start oh uh, note to everybody do not go through a car wash with a little stubby antenna mine broke off so <laughs> Anyway, uh, let's see here. Try to get a... It's warmed up, so it's not really a cold start or anything, but we'll, we'll see what she does here. All right, so that's how loud it is. But, uh, all right, well, thanks for watching the video. Sorry, the video is shaky. I'm getting just new to all this stuff. So, uh, all right, I appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.